Hi, this is David Atkinson with City National Foreign Exchange, and this is Global Perspectives. We're in a short season of central bank meetings uh, with the Bank of Canada and ECB meeting this week. The Swiss National Bank meets next week, and the U.S. Fed and the Bank of Japan both meet in a couple of weeks on the 21st. And any time we have these little short seasons, uh, it seems like the markets focus on policy and effectiveness or lack thereof. One of my colleagues uh, actually brought out an old naval term that was given to the crew that said that beatings will continue until morale improves. And clearly in the central bank context, the idea is that some central banks will keep doing a lot of these policies, which frankly look to be ineffective until something changes in the markets. We got an interesting example of that this week with the ECB meeting. Uh, President Mario Draghi uh, was expected at the press conference to talk about possibly different asset classes that the bank would purchase. See, the ECB has been doing QQE for a couple of years. That's quantitative and qualitative easing. And the markets really were focusing on that qualitative part. The issue is that this program expires in March of 2017, which isn't all that far away, yet the ECB has not met its GDP or its inflation goals. And frankly, it's running out of bonds that it can buy from corporates, uh, partly because of some self-imposed restrictions. So markets were wondering, will Mr. Draghi maybe go to equities? Yeah, that's right, a central bank possibly purchasing stocks as monetary policy. Now in the end, Mr. Draghi said it wasn't discussed, but of course that makes it topic number one for the next uh, meeting or two down the road. It does lead me to my view, which is it's another example of how these extraordinary monetary measures really are ineffective, frankly. Uh, I don't really blame the central bankers as much as I blame the lack of action by politicians and other authorities for fiscal and structural reform, which is what's really needed. Thank you very much and have a great weekend.